devil in the deep set. <laughs> just arrived in Wakefield for today's uh, match between Wakefield, Trinity and Salford Red Devils. The two team lineups are, are, are like this today. Wakefield lineup with Max Jowett, Ben Jones Bishop, Joe Rundle, Reese Lynn, Tom Johnston, Jacob Milner, Liam Finn, Nick Scruton, Scott Moore, Anthony England, Danny Kerman, Matty Ashurst, Mikkel Co, Jason Walton, T. Ran Aroma, Mikkel Simon, and Johnny Molloy. Salford lineup with Gareth O'Brien, Justin Carney, Junior Sal, Josh Jones, Josh Griffin, Josh Wood, Michael Dobson, Craig Kopjack, Logan Tompkins, George Griffin, Ben Murdoch Masella, Matt Sarsfield, Mark Flanagan, Nia Levels, Adam Wall, Jordan Wall, and Kyle Forster. We've got about 45 minutes to kick off. Massive game again for Salford today here in Yorkshire. Wakefield Salford, 250 kickoff. It just shows that really, I mean, week before when we were at home, fuck yeah. Yeah. She was there with baby then. Yeah. And in the mind, in the It's half time here at the uh, at Bellevue. It's Wakefield leading 16 points to 12. Wakefield got to the perfect start, really. J Jacob Miller scoring. He's been the falling our side in the first half, really creating a lot there at standoff for Wakefield. Uh, Salford uh, went 12 points down with another Wakefield try. I'm not too, too sure who scored that one, to be honest. I couldn't see from where I'm stood in the stand. But Salford got back into it, you know. Uh, a great try from Gareth O'Brien off a lovely pass from Michael Dobson and then Matt Sarsfield got his level with another lovely try great work from Dobson who's, who's been brilliant so far with, with the boot you know Penny Wakefield back he created that lovely ball to O'Brien who put Sarsfield in 12 apiece but from the kickoff Ben Murdoch Masala made a mistake in the following set near our line and uh, Jacob Miller's put a lovely high bomb in the air Josh Griffin failed to deal with it and uh, Wakefield have gone over in the corner with a try from Tom Johnston uh, the goal was missed by Liam Finn, but it's all for the trail in 16 points to 12 at half time. Well, the second half got off to a poor start for Salford with Tom Johnston going in for the Wildcats to make it 22 points to 12. Um, Salford got back within a score when Justin Carney went over to bring the scores to 22 points to 18. But Salford left themselves too much to do this afternoon. Uh, 22, 22-18 uh, now and Carney went over. We looked we look the better side but weren't clinical enough, didn't take our chances and then allow Wakefield to go over. A real sucker punch try from uh, Reece Lynn going over. Finn kicking the goal to make it 28-18 when we'd been on top. So Wakefield back in there. You know, poor, really poor defending at the end. And Johnson, who's had a, a great game for, uh, for Wakefield. Real, real hot stepper on the wing there. He's gone over a couple of minutes towards the end to make the score 32 points to 18 to, to Wakefield. Finn missed the, the final conversion there. So all in all, poor, poor display for Salford today. Played well in patches, had plenty of ball, not been clinical at all with it. And I'm really, really disappointed. We need to build up for next week. We've got Leeds at home next week, so uh, so on, on to that now. But disappointing today not to get the win here at Wakefield in a game we should have won. Final score at Wakefield was Wakefield Trinity Wildcats 32, Salford 18.